This ain't last year. Teamwork. 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 Is a is a rare bird you could say um, first of all he's not your typical 65 year old if you were to look at Michael Michael's in pretty darn good shape um, he uh, spends a lot of time in the gym he uh, works very hard and and attitude wise I, we just love having him on the team he's there he's on time he's running he's he's encouraging uh, his other uh, teammates all right that's you way to go baby way to go way to go I ain't doing nothing. I ain't doing nothing. Did you get my little pint of blood? Mike, what's going on today with this? With you guys blowing these guys? Seems like we're just doing everything right, and uh, just uh, every play is just busting loose. And our quarterback Rooster is just off the charts today. Very talented, and he's just uh, whatever he's doing is working. A lot of game left, though, Dan. Well, people have asked me at times whether you know Michael's too old to play, and and uh, my feeling is absolutely not. If you're in shape and you think you can play, absolutely you should play. Um, the person who shouldn't play is the one who's not in shape, or the, uh, we'll call him the weekend warrior who just comes out and doesn't get in shape. And you know, football is a rough sport. You can get hurt at any age, at any time. Um, and these guys, that's, they, they, how do I say this? They don't care. They're here because they love this sport. And uh, it's the hardest thing in the world to leave this sport because um, you can't go out any place else but the same kind of camaraderie and and uh, you know we've had people that have been injured and their view they they don't care if they can play um, I had my son once tell me if I can walk off the field I'm not coming off the only way I'm coming off the field is carried so that's just the mentality whether you're 20 or whether you're 65 it just sticks with you to those 30s, you know, you lose a little bit, but you know, I, st I still feel good. I still feel like I still got a little bit in me, you know. I'm not like how I was when I was 21, but I can still move around and, and make things happen for the team. Now, talking about your age, you being 34. Yeah. Now, have you asked Michael Lynch, who's 65, <sighs> double your age? Uh, I man, mean, that's, how that's, would you compare that? You know, like Mike, man, Lynch, that is amazing. You know, 65, for him to get out and still come out here and compete, go hard, you know, he don't want us to take it light on him, he participated in everything that we do, you know, he, he's just, it's just unbelievable to be that age and to be able to come out here and play this game still. An inspiration to players of all ages and to see him in his, his physical abilities and his physical conditioning, uh, it is again uh, something inspiring to these younger players that are on this team. Um, again, dedication, desire, and discipline that he has and, and exhibits on the field and off the field uh, is exemplary. 
and is, it's, a, it's a treat to have someone on the field to be a leader in that regard. Hey, come down, Hey, come down, Oh, hey. Cliff, what's happening? Hey, <laughs> hey man, congratulations, yeah, congratulations man. Hey, Cliff. You got, you got it, man. Y'all did it, man. Hey, it's, uh, I tell you, I mean, your game was the toughest. Yeah, it's all good, man. Hey. You know, and then, you know, the Rage game, which I didn't even go to, unfortunately. And right. then this was just, you know, look, thank God we put 28, 30, 40 up on them as quick as we did. Well, if it ain't hard, it ain't, it ain't worth it, man. Hey, man, and we'll keep in touch always. And all right. I wish I could stay around for the All-Star game, but I got to leave again and go back to New York. Well, it's all good. Congratulations hey, to your Cliff. champion, man. Hey, my pleasure, buddy. Hey, right, love you, man. Take care, Cliff. that everybody that wants to play at this age can have the feeling that I have to play because it's really not about me it's it's just about the feeling I have around my teammates and being on that sideline and being able to contribute just a little each game it's the greatest feeling in the world it's, uh, I'm humbled you're gonna be glad to be wearing that ring uh, it's gonna be great it's gonna be a lot of fun I mean that's gonna be pretty cool actually you know the wife's gonna be jealous that your uh, diamond <laughs> yes, ring coming yes, to the hey you yes. never know you never know I'm sure they're gonna be nice ones so we'll see what happens but it's been a pleasure it's been a pleasure Dad. Oh, yeah. 